The annual cut-a-thon to benefit Locks of Love is taking place as we speak. The donations are all going to be used to create high-quality wigs and hair pieces for children. It's happening right now at the Rio Spa and Salon at the Rio Casino and Hotel, and it's happening all day long until 5 o'clock to hear us to talk about it a little bit with uh, Sparkle and Barb. Thank you so much for joining us today. Hello. Yes, we're happy to be here. So tell me a little bit about um, who needs these um, hair pieces and wigs. So these hair pieces are for children under the age of 21 that have been affected by cancer we want to just make them feel good about themselves and um, tell me a little bit about just what's happening today and how to get the word out so today is our annual cut-a-thon we um, are collecting donations all throughout the day from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. in fact people are in the salon right now getting their haircuts um, come on in there's no appointment necessary we just need 10 inches of hair 10 inches of hair okay inches does of it, hair. where does that start that 10 inches does it have to be uh, a ponytail ponytail or? okay so at the nape of the neck um, we've had donors up to 27 inches, so the longer the better. We actually have a contest today for the catch of the day. Oh. So the longest ponytail will receive a wonderful prize pack for okay. products and services at the Rio Spa. At the same time as giving back. Yes. So that's fantastic. Yes. So if you don't have hair that's at least 10 inches from your ponytail, is there another way that you can get involved? You can donate, um, make a financial donation that offsets the cost of the production of the wigs. Talk to me a little bit about the need that you see, um, not just in Las Vegas, but I'm sure across Nevada as a whole. Well, as a, as a whole, for it, it's, it's just wonderful to see children donating, especially children, taking like so many inches off of their hair because they are going to help another child. And it's just wonderful to see that happening, you know. It's just, it's a great, great opportunity for them. And you were yeah. saying some celebrities or some big name people from in, yes. uh, in town are there right now. Um, it was that was seven years ago, uh, Sparkle helped launch this and I asked Penn Gillette from Penn and Teller to donate his ponytail. And after 25 years having his ponytail, he cut 10 inches off of it and we donated it to Lax Love. Teller was the one that cut it. I <laughs> cracked it and he cut it. Yeah. So Pendulette can do it. Anyone can do it. That's then. right. <laughs> Pen, Penn's just a fantastic, fantastic person when it comes to um, charity events and all that. You know. So. And have you been able to talk to some of the people who've been able to benefit from um, these events? Uh, we have not. Um, but we know that we've, over the past seven years, we've sent in over 700 ponytails. It takes six ponytails to make one wig. So we've touched the lives of over 100 children, so we feel good about that. Oh, that's amazing. And do you see a lot of people returning or just a lot yes. of feedback? Yes. We have uh, some people that have repeat every couple of years. They come in and see us. Um, we have people that have cut their ponytails in the past, and they bring in their ponytails with us. So, you know, we're the vampires for hair. Yeah. So we'll take anything. <laughs> right, just yeah, come on yeah, in. We'll make it work. Come on in. Bring, bring your ponytails even if you had to cut that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's great advice. And right. if you can't make it out there today, you said that you can donate any day of the year. Yes. Um, this is something that we do all year long. Okay. Um, this is just our big event to kind of raise awareness and um, have a little fun with it. But any day, if you're not quite at 10 inches yet, come see us in a couple of months. Perfect. No Perfect. appointment necessary. And if you do have the 10 inches until 5 o'clock tonight, you can go to the Rio. We'll put all the information in case you missed any of it up on our website. That's KTNB.com.